Okay, this trailer that I'm getting ready to check out, it was recommended to me specifically by someone on my channel. I had seen it kind of floating around and just kind of noticed it in passing, but didn't know what it was about. I still don't know what it's about. It's for something called Katla. And I didn't realize until I went searching for it to put it in my to-watch list that it's a Netflix production either a show or a movie. I don't know. I didn't read the description. I'm going into this totally blind. All I know is the title and what I see here on the opening shot, which looks like a crashed or old plane or something like that. So let's go ahead and see what this is about. I don't know why I, I want to say I think this is foreign language, but it, but that I, I have no idea why I'm getting that impression, but I've been wrong about that before. So... Let's just go ahead and see. Trúir þau? Já. Þjóð svona. Það er að við það breyst í gegnum tíðina. En það eru byggðar á undarlegum aðbyrðum. Sipum þessum sem við erum að upplifa núna. Er þetta manneskja? Is this like Norwegian or Swedish or something? Það er að mennið. Mastu ekki eftir neinu? Og svo byrjaði að sko fallið. Hvað þá? Hvernig getur það verið að sjá líf? Hoppi. Okkur er alltaf svona skrýtt um mig. Það er þess bara eftir að hafa verið horfin í heilt ár. Ég er bara búin að vera hér. Það er eitthvað í gangi þarna búið jökli. Það er svo sem ekki fyrst að skipti sem að kalla leipir einhvern með húð og hári og og spýtir honum svo aftur löngu setna. Does it change them? I can't explain it, but you two are the same person, it's obvious. She thinks that she's me. Og hvað er það væru vísindi á bak og þjóðsvöld? Hvað? Af hverju er þetta að gerast? Af hverju er það að koma til bak? The sun comes up, the sun goes down, we're born, we die. Who am I to question the nature of things? So the date of this is June 17th. So it's only 17, 18 days away. This is intriguing to me. You know what this kind of reminds me of? It's not the same, but it just... The tone and the atmosphere, they kind of remind me of this show that I had started watching. I haven't finished it. I think it's got one more season left. It kind of went off the rails in season two, but it was this show called Fortitude. I loved that show. The first season of that was excellent. It was so, so good. And I can't remember where it takes place. The area. I mean, it was an English language show, but there were a lot of people from other, like, what's his name? The guy who played in um, Game of Thrones as, what was his name? Dundarian or whatever. The guy who could come back to life. He was in it. And then the girl who played in, I don't know her name, but she played in the recent HBO show called um, The Undoing. She also played in the original 1990-ish, uh, 97, 96 movie called Night Watch. The one that was, I think it was 96, 97. I can't remember. Well, they redid that with Ewan McGregor in the part. Uh, but she played in the original one, which also had the dude from Game of Thrones, um, Cersei's brother, Nikolai, whatever, I can never remember his full name, anyway, but this kind of reminds me of that, like there's something supernatural-ish going on, and yet in a weird way, it kind of makes some organic sense because of the way the story is put together, and so that thinking of fortitude is kind of what draws me to this. Now, I'm sure it's going to be completely different from Fortitude because it's a totally different. This is about 
looks like what some monster or creature in the volcano or something if, if I'm interpreting that correctly I'm a little brain dead right now so stuff might be going right over my head but I'm drawn to it just because of the the creepy aspect of it and because the atmosphere of it reminds me so much of that show I liked I don't think I recognize anybody in here but that's okay however Whenever I get around to watching this, it's going to have to be something that I can put my full focus on, obviously, as you can see, because it's subtitled, unless Netflix offers dubbed. Like I said before, I don't usually like dubbed on live action movies or shows because I get really distracted by the fact that the, um, that the, the mouth movements don't match the, don't match the voice, but on cartoons, it's fine because that's easy to cover up, but this will have to be something that I have to put complete attention on. However, it it is something that interests me. So I, I will probably check this out. It's not going to be too much longer. The trailer was not that long at all to get to the screen right here. It just clocks in at under two minutes. So pretty efficiently done. I mean, you, you kind of have the idea of what this is going to be about. But certainly there's a lot of mystery that remains so you don't know completely but you know enough to kind of that hook has been set so yeah this looks quite intriguing and I'll check it out at some point but you guys know me I have no idea when it will really happen when it does and if I really like this enough to make a review on it I'll do that at some point but for now I'm going to move on to something else so see you later guys bye <laughs>